welcome back to my channel my viewers and my subscribers i am just here today and i am giving you guys an update on how i prune my tomato plants for bigger tomatoes so our, our bigger harvest so please remember to like comment and subscribe and please watch the video from the starting to the end i would really appreciate it so much so as you guys can see i have my tomatoes right there they are they are looking very healthy and very wonderful so what i'm going to show you guys you guys can see down below here the leaf the lower leaves are actually touching the soil that shouldn't been happening i should have har i should have been snipping off the all of these right there i should have been cutting them off i should have started to prune these plants were much earlier but i didn't so i am going to do it now and i'm going to show you guys take you guys along while i am pruning these four plants growing in two gallon container and then i will take you guys over to the ones in the five gallon container so what i am going to do and this is a very good thing when you are actually growing your tomatoes in containers my viewers it much easier it, it, it your container will jize out take a longer time to jize out and it is very good for the bearing of your tomato plants so your tomatoes will actually focus on the fruit more than focusing on the lower growth that is actually not good so something was growing in the container right there so i'm taking it out and you guys should never prune your tomato plants above the fruit because you guys can get actually get sunburn and the fruit of your plant your, your fruit if you actually take off the leaf above it you should always take off the lower leaves so i'm taking out these small branches right there right there looking wonderful so you guys can see right there and then i'm stepping off right there so if you guys would love to actually you guys can actually take off the lower leaves and the stem that you actually take off of your tomato plant like this right there and you guys could put it in water and these little small hairs on the stem of this tomato limb it is actually root my views so if you put this stem in water for a couple days you guys will see some roots started to grow on this stem right there so you guys can actually put it in a smaller container and it could start it to grow so a small fruit was actually on it but i cut it down as well i don't want it on the plant so right there you guys can see you guys could put it in a small container and it will start it to root in some water and it started to root and then you guys could transplant it into a smaller container and then transplant into your garden so right here you guys can actually see look how lovely this plant actually looks now very wonderful and the container will actually take a take a longer time to jize out but i love to water my plants every day two times a day one time in the morning and one time in the evening so i'm going to go ahead right here now and i'm going to snip this one as well so these tomatoes are looking very beautiful my viewers and i really love the way how they are actually turning out so i'm snipping this branch right there snipping this one right there and look how lovely very wonderful i am getting some maybe some heat burn right here on these tomatoes but the, these ones right here are doing wonderful and the rest of them but these two got burned so i'm just throwing those away and look how lovely is these ones right there and i had that one right there to prune as well and these are all the leaves that is actually coming off since i started to prune you guys can see right there so i'm going to prune this one as well so you guys can stay tuned i'm going to take you guys back soon as i finish so i actually finished now my views you guys can actually see 
right there looking very lovely right there coming down and this one right there looking beautiful coming over right there looking wonderful as well and this one right there some very beautiful fruit and these are all the branches that I take off so I'm going to take you guys along over to my one over to my another plants growing in the five gallon container so stay tuned and keep watching so here are my now my views I am actually over by my five gallon containers so I started to prune you guys can see these are the branches that I take off some of them is very tall but I actually still take them off so you guys can see some beautiful fruit right there coming right down over here as well I need to actually chillis these tomatoes very soon because the steak that I use to stake them is actually growing out so I am going to stake them very soon you guys can stay tuned for that look how beautiful right there so I had three more plants to actually prune my views so I am going to prune them very soon look how beautiful very wonderful my views I really love how these tomatoes are actually bearing this one right here is not doing so well I don't sure if it is the seed of the tomato that I plant but it is not responding so well but these ones are doing wonderful you guys can actually see right there looking so beautiful and this one as well so I am going to finish prune these three plants and take you guys back so stay tuned so I actually finished the, all of them now my views you guys can see down below very clearly and they are looking very wonderful I need to take out these branches right there okay so what I am going to do now my viewers I am going to till my cell just like this so whenever time you are actually growing your plants in your garden or in your containers my viewers this is cannot be too many too much so whenever time you guys get the chance to do to till your soil you guys can do it because it let your root get a lot of oxygen inside of your root so you just go ahead and till your soil just like this and your plants will be very happy with it and then it, look, it is actually looking like I need to add some more soil very soon some top dressing and these tomato plants and I have a color loop plant right there it is looking beautiful I soon harvest it my viewers the reason why I cannot harvest it today is because I spray my plants so I cannot harvest any of my color loo today you guys can see so I'm just tilling the soil so it will help with that with the, the pruning that I do so the plants will be very very happy right there very lovely my viewers so what I'm going to do I'm going to finish till all of them when I'm finished but my plants are looking beautiful and I really love that you guys can see right there I'm going to go this way I'm going to take up the all of the leaf branches when I am finished so you guys can see from this angle they are looking very beautiful so if this if this is your first time to my channel please consider like comment and subscribe and stay tuned for a lot more update and a lot more grow in the future so over here now is my beautiful bell peppers you guys can see looking lovely they are doing very wonderful my viewers right there and I have quite a few of them you guys can see over here as well my garden is doing so beautiful so lovely I really love to show it off my viewers I did need to do these ones as well I don't do them as yet but I am not going to do them on camera I'm going to actually prune them when I'm done they have on a lot of tomato my viewers but they are actually small so I'm going to prune the plants for the tomato to get bigger and over here my viewers are my carrot plants right there 
looking wonderful over here are my sketch bunny peppers so they are doing wonderful and these was the first ones that I prune these are my callaloo these are some more of my callaloo right there over here is my lettuce that I transplant the other day right there are some more of my bell pepper these are my beautiful cucumbers right there looking very lovely coming over here my views they are looking very beautiful and over here is the rest of my cabbages look how beautiful are these cabbages my viewers and the, all of them is actually going into some two gallon container look how beautiful very beautiful my viewers so i want to say to you all thank you guys so much for watching i really appreciate it so much one love to you all until next time i'm out